Welcome back to Asian Barbecue Boy. So today's episode, we'll be cooking two beef short ribs. Let's get it! Just picked up two beef short ribs from James Brothers Meat and Coke. So what we want to do first is pat it dry. And when once we pat it dry, take out the fat layer and the membrane. Yeah. That way, when we smoke them in the weather, um, the smoke can penetrate the meat, so we can give them a nice uh, smoky flavor. So when we're done, use mustard as the binding agent to allow for the rub to stick on the, to the meat. Using the hardcore carnival black as the rub for today's beef short ribs. We want to apply it very liberally to create that nice bark. We'll be smoking these beef short ribs on the Weber kettle today. It should take us about eight hours. The first four hours is for us to develop a nice bark around the rib, which would be, we'll be smoking at around 225 to 250 degrees Fahrenheit. Once we hit the four hour mark, we're gonna wrap it with some pucha paper. That way we can tenderize the meat and make sure like the meat is cooked nicely. So at the four hour mark, we have three options. We can wrap the meat, we can foil or with butcher paper, or we can leave the meat naked. In order to get a nice smoky flavor for the beef short ribs, we've been using two pieces of hickory wood. This has a really, really nice flavor that will penetrate the beef. Also been using a water tray, which will be left directly underneath the beef short ribs. That way it helps us with the moisture so the beef doesn't dry out. We're going to be using the low and slow cooking method today. The optimal temperature in order to smoke these ribs would be at around 225 degrees Fahrenheit to 250. That way we don't dry out the meat and ensure that the meat is nice and moist at the end of the cook. Alright, now it's hitting about 225 and we're ready to put the ribs in. When putting the lid back on, we want the vent to be directly on top of the ribs so that the smoke can go over towards the ribs and we can ensure that the smoke penetrates the ribs. Yeah. The next game plan is to cook the beef ribs uncovered for four hours. By every hour leading up to the four hours, we make sure that we split the beef so that the outside doesn't dry up. So this solution is three quarters apple juice and one quarter apple cider vinegar. Going. With all barbecues, a lot of things can happen unexpectedly. In our case today, we had two different size beef short ribs. One side is actually to temp and the other one is still about 15 degrees off. The smaller one, now that it's up to temp, I'm going to wrap it up in our butcher paper and I'll show you how I do that. I'm going to put two knobs of butter. I'm going to get my rub that I used just like that for the bark and I'm gonna spritz just to keep it moist also to note this is my first time cooking beef ribs period so I was a bit nervous did a lot of research so I'm hoping I'm fingers crossed hoping that we did okay let's go have a look Very good. Holy shit. Wow guys, I've actually outdone myself. I'm so hungry. Nine and a half hours worth of work. Let's give it a crack. Mm. Wow. <laughs> oh, wow, so good. Mm. Mm. Probably. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this barbecue, don't forget to like, comment, and most importantly, subscribe. Please put it in the comments below what you would like us to cook in our next video.